Hello, you amazing people. It is Riley LH here with another video, and today we're actually working on taillights for the Miata. So I used to not be a fan of clear taillights, but for some reason, they've really been growing on me. And even if I don't like the look of the clear taillights, I can always go and just sell them for a pretty good profit. I got these taillights used. Now they're just the cheap eBay clear taillights, and you normally see them on the spray painted crappy junked out Miatas. And then the full clear taillights are literally the same exact thing, just with these red lenses popped out, and they're like a few hundred dollars extra. So we're going to try to make some of those today. Now all we're really using is some type of pry tools like screwdrivers, chisels, and then I also have a knife and a heat gun. Now yes, you can use an oven or something of the sort, but I don't feel like melting my taillights and I don't trust myself enough, so we're just going to be sticking with the heat gun, taking it slow. Now these lenses can crack very easy, especially used ones like these. So you got to be very careful when taking them apart. But if we take our time and pry up, we should be able to get this off pretty easily. Okay, so we're going to start off by stripping everything off the back of the tail light. So now that we all got that out, we're going to take our heat gun and we're just going to heat up this area. I'm going to do front and back because there's a line of glue that goes around. So once we heat that up, we can pop a screwdriver under it and pry that off and slowly take it off and then we'll put our screwdriver in here and pop these red lenses out. Now it's not ideal to do this on a day like today where it's freezing cold, but hey, we're gonna do it anyways. So there's a little clip right there that we are going to have to work around. So we're going to get our screwdriver in there and get it to pop around. Just like so. Now it can work down more. And there's another one of those clips right there. So we're going to heat this area up a good bit more than everywhere else. And then pop that out. The aim of this game is slow and steady and just taking everything with a good amount of heat and prying it slowly to make sure we don't crack this lens. And just like that, we got it all apart. So now we're just gonna go ahead and fully pull this all off. So now it's actually time to get these red lenses off. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our screwdriver and we're gonna put it behind and we're just gonna smack it against the table. So we got the small lens, which was pretty easy to pop out. Now this big one is still not being very fun to pop out. So We're just going to keep on doing this for a while until we hopefully get this red lens out. Way too long later, we finally got this stupid red lens out, so we can just... Yeah. Okay, so we're going to shove this glue back in here and heat it all up and then pop our lens back in. And just like that, the clear taillights are done and on the car. And I'm extremely happy with how they look. I think in total we spent about $70 on these taillights. And now I did crack one of the lenses. I'm pretty sure I cracked it when I was putting it back on. But they've been on the car for the past few months and they have been working great. They don't really get any water in them. And I've been really happy with them in general. Now one thing you do have to do is either replace or paint your brake light bulb. The proper thing you're supposed to do is replace the brake light bulb with a red one. Because otherwise it's just going to shine clear. But as a last minute thing to get the tail lights in the car and the car back on the roads, I just spray painted the brake light bulb red. And well, it's worked perfectly fine. Now, I don't recommend doing it, but if you gotta do what you gotta do, it will work. But all in all, I'm super happy with the tails, and they're so cheap that I don't have to worry about destroying them at the track, because for another like 70 bucks, I can just make another set. But if you guys enjoyed this video or learned anything from it, like, comment, subscribe, check out my other social medias. It would mean the absolute world to me, and I hope you guys have a great day. See you guys all next time. Peace out.